All right, welcome to another two for two video. And today's topic is suicide awareness and prevention. The reason why this topic came up is because of YouTuber Logan Paul posted a vlog of him in Japan in the suicide forest and he showed a dead body in the video. If you haven't seen this, Google it or YouTube it. This video is not gonna be a bash video. I'm not gonna bash on him. The reason why I made this video is my thoughts on suicide after watching his video about uh, suicide prevention. I give him props for actually going out and learn about suicide and to get involved in the prevention of suicide. Everyone's human and everyone makes mistakes. It's how you deal with those mistakes after you've made them that gives you character. Anyone can say sorry after making a mistake, but going out, taking the initiative to better yourself from those mistakes. So has suicide affected me? First of all, if I ask myself, have, have I ever had suicidal thoughts? I'm gonna say yes, because there's been times where I've been depressed enough to think why, what's the point? What's the point living? But has it gone to a point where I thought enough about suicide to take action? No. And I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful for the people that surround me and the people that I choose to surround myself with. Have my friends or family, from what I can think of, no. I really hope if they have issues with suicide that they're able to come to me for help, talk to me. I try to be that available to them. Last summer, so summer of 2017, I volunteered for Vancouver International Film Festival as a videographer. One of the videos that I watched, it was a documentary filmed in Japan and it follows this Buddhist priest and suicide counselor. And he goes out and reaches out to people who have suicidal thoughts. He tries to prevent by being there for them by giving them someone to talk to. I'll link the link to the video below. In the description below this video, there is a link to the BC Crisis Center contacts information. There is crisis centers throughout BC to help you. If you are not feeling like yourself and need someone to talk to, most of these crisis centers are 24 seven. Don't be afraid to reach out. Anyway, for the people that are watching, this channel and who are having trouble by all means reach out to me i'll answer emails comment in the youtube send me a dm i'll chat with you thanks for watching share like subscribe imscore out